Hi guys. Oh, where do I begin? Um, got a coffee here. This coffee time is not going to be like normal where it's once the coffee's done, the video's done. I'm just going to drop a, something for you to think about and then the video's going to be done. Okay? Yes, this is a big cup of coffee. This is my regular cup. It's quite large. Now, I've recently got into crypto investing. So I bought some crypto coins and, and whatnot and I'm watching my money go up and down and whatnot. And it got me to thinking about what's going on with this Budweiser thing. Namely, the one thing that people aren't paying attention to. Okay, now hear me out. I'm not a financial advisor, okay? But I think someone at Anheuser at Bush, a Budweiser, needs to listen to this. Your marketing VP purposely tanked you so that you will fire her. Now, hear me out. Who would willingly want to get fired? Okay. A person who would willingly want to get fired is either someone that has been hired by a rival, i.e. they're getting ready to hire her after her non-disclosure is over. Okay. And she wants to tank you so that other beers beat you in sales which they are right now but at the same time she's financially fucking you over now let me explain what's the one thing companies always give anyone in an office position as a bonus not just money stocks stocks and shares think about it for a second she goes in purposefully does something that she knows will either a make a shit ton of money on the stock market up front immediately i.e budweiser's embraced by the lgbtq plus a a a a a element and a people whatever okay embraced by them okay they start chugging that fucking piss water you want to call a light beer by the way the fact that it's a light beer it should automatically be aimed at girly men a real man doesn't care about fucking calories all right i'm sorry we just don't all right anyway now that being said yes your stocks are going down how many shares does she have think wait for it okay you fire her she has her golden parachute okay in the form of what stocks bonds now you think to yourself okay we're giving those shit bonds because we're down great she then leaks it to the media that she's been sacked that they've won they start buying their product back they start buying your beer back all of a sudden your stocks go right back up again in fact they go higher are you starting to see now that shitty stock that you were more than willing to give her for 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 freaking pennies, not even penny, less than pennies, fruit me bits on the dollar. Yeah? Is now worth its weight in in in, in Dogecoin. In, in Dogecoin. In Bitcoin. In 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 whatever. She then waits, it peaks, she sells, she's now leaving with an additional 20, 30, 40 million. Onto your competitor. And even if you slap her with a, a, a freaking, what, uh, I think the match you can give them is like a, a, a four year non-compete. She can sit on her laurels for four years with that amount of money. And wait, and then all of a sudden, Cause has picked her up. Or, or Guinness has picked her up. Or someone else has picked her up. The people that have basically hired her to tank you. Just a food for thought. Just a food for thought. When I was working at a deli factory, I was contacted. And even the agency that hired me told me that we would get people try to reach out to us and ask us to, to, to sabotage the factory. Work that out. 
people would come to us and offer us money to break a conveyor belt or underweigh something or, or or slip this in the food or slip that in the food so this batch goes bad so that company so so that that pr- company that we're making the food for gets a bad name then all of a sudden they trace it back to the factory the factory gets a bad name etc etc oh yeah corporate espionage is everywhere and that's genuinely what i think this is i think this is a huge case of corporate espionage think about it it's a win-win for her she is a frat boy she even turned around and said, we got to get rid of this frat by image. We're losing... No, 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 no. For, 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 for Christ's sake, America, stop drinking light beer, you pussies. Grow a pair. Guys, men, if you're worried about calories, pick up your man purse and your fanny pack and fuck off. All right? Be a real man. Drink something decent. Alright? At the end of the day. At the end of the day, guys. Follow the money. Yeah. Budweiser's down 60 something percent. So you're telling me if she asks for a a, a, a stock et- equity... In her golden parachute. Budweiser's not going to see that as a win. Are you fucking stupid? Of course they would. They'd be like, okay, so you want worthless stock. Not actual Benjamins. Here, give her 10,000. Give her 50,000. Give her 60,000. Not realizing that the moment she signs those papers. It gets released to the press. That she's sacked. That the right has won. What's the right going to do? They're going to celebrate. They're going to start buying your fucking shit beer again. Sales are going to go through the roof. Your stock's going to go through the roof because that's what stocks do. Supply and demand. And that 50,000 shares or X amount of shares that you just gave that woman have increased how many fold? So not only has she played you, not only has she played everyone, she thinks she's played herself. And I'm a simpleton who's just getting into stocks and shares and stuff like that. And I can see this. Why hasn't anyone reported on this? I legit am watching a uh, uh, Tim Cast's uh, 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 a podcast from last night. Unfortunately, I fell asleep and missed it. But the point is, they're talking about the whole lot. Lo- have lost five billion. Okay, you're telling me, okay, that she's not got a golden parachute waiting for her. Corporate espionage and. St- Stock ma- and stock manipulation is a thing. Okay? If I was the FTC, I would be investigating this shit. I mean it. If Budweiser has actually offered to this chick, you know, to, 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 to whoever her name is, uh, uh, stocks and shares, if I was the FTC, I would immediately put a halt to it. I would say, nope. I would lock... Budweiser's shares at whatever it was. Because that is market manipulation. Think about it for a second. It is market manipulation. Just food for thought. Thanks for sticking by. Subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one.